Hello everyone. Uh, today, um, this first I want to make actually want to make a few videos today, and uh, this first one will be a video request by uh, Bart. His name is Bart. His his, his uh, YouTube name is Bartization, and I will be making a video response to uh, for him. Okay, he's interested in Estonian resources, and he I guess he's planning on moving over to Estonian. That's great. That's 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 great. And uh, he would just would like he would like to know what resource I'm using for learning Estonian. So what I'm going to do is show I'm going to show you the resource I'm using now, and all uh, everything I'm doing to learn Estonian. Okay. So um, first of all, I have this is my Estonian phrase book. This is a dictionary and phrase book. Now it's a limited dictionary, so I'll advise you to look for a better dictionary I've been searching for one myself I haven't found a found one I have there's an online just go to Google type in um, Estonian online dictionary and you'll get a dictionary but I think that one's limited as well so yeah you want to get a better dictionary get in like I always say get both ways English or English Estonian Estonian English okay so this is the first this is my phrase book I have for Estonian all right and I have this Estonian teach yourself. Estonian teach yourself. I don't know what to say. I don't know much more to say about this Estonian teach yourself. It's good, like all the other teach yourselves. Very good book. Comes with audio. Okay. Uh, the next resource uh, I have this here. I'll show you. I just recently got this over on Uzi Translation. Now I will post a link up for you. If you don't have an account over there, I will I will I would advise you to make an account because they have a lot of good resources. Okay. So basic course in Estonian by Felix J. Oinus. This this course here is very good. I glimpsed through it. I went through the first chapter and I like how they got things set up. It's great. Okay, it's a little different from Teach Yourself, but it's they it's very very useful, and I love it. So I'll just give you a quick overview of this course here, and uh, believe me, it's it's worth downloading. It's it's worth it. So I'm using this here at the same time, in conjunction with Teach Yourself. Now, one thing I I compare this to Teach Yourself. Let's see. Let me get to it. Okay, unit one. Now, one thing I can I, like comparing this to teach yourself. Like unit one starts off with some very useful stuff. Oh, well, unit unit one and teach yourself, teach yourself also starts off with some very useful, useful stuff. But here, there are a lot of uh, keywords here. Very very useful words you will learn here. You see. And how they do it, they break it down first. They have the Estonian on the left and they have the English on the right. So they give you the Estonian word. And then as you scroll down, they break it down. like So they have like and, you, your, and how are you. And they put those two words in that sentence. They show you how to put it in a sentence. Okay. Let me find a... Yeah, so look, these are very important words. Uh, a little, speak a little, repeat. Those keywords. Only a little bit. Stuff like that. Only. They had only here. I was surprised to see only. They introduced only in this chapter. So, yeah, definitely download this. And like I said, if you don't have an account over on Uzi Translation, you better download it. You better sign up, sign up right now because they have some good stuff over here. And this is actually... Uh, this is probably the best Estonian resource they had over there. I have to look at the other ones, but so far this one, um, this one is great. So they give you it's, it's just a bunch of breakdown. They break they break down. Um, they give you the vocabulary and they put it in a sentence for you. You see, so they have like bottle, like here for example, bottle beer, a bottle of beer, please. Just now, we don't have any. 
beer now. So they put all that stuff in context. They break it down for you. They just don't give you the vocabulary. They, they show you how to put it together. As far as grammar, um, yeah, they go into the grammar. They have the grammar section you can go into and and see. And I like how they. This is great. They give you example sentences, and they explain certain things. So the grammar section is good to look at. Also, they talk about the case nominative case. If you want to understand about that stuff, they have all that there for you. Okay. Possession to have, and then they give you the opposite to not have. So yeah, I really like this course. This course is great. So um, you can get this course, and you can get Teach Yourself. I like to, personally. I like to use. I like to work from two different courses because it, I mean I just like to do that. It's good to work from two different courses. To most people, it may seem redundant, but I, I like to do that. Okay. So yeah, these are the resources I'm using for Estonia. So you might want to get this basic course in Estonia. All right. Now. Another thing I do is um, I go to the uh, I go to the like YouTube I go to YouTube and I for my listening even if you're a beginner you can do this it doesn't matter okay because listening is important so some one of my um, let me see let me find a site find a uh, shoot did I forget to you to to Yuri Kucha yeah. So one of my Estonian buddies sent me this message here. He's been helping me with some Estonian stuff, and he he sent me this. Uh, he told me to go to this um, type in to to Yuri Kuja, and they have a whole bunch of um, it's like sort of comedy, uh, some comedy shows for Estonian, and um, yeah. Let me see. So I, I come here and I'll listen to, uh, you know, I don't understand everything. I understand some words, but that's not the, the point. The point is coming here and getting listening practice. And it's so it's, it's so fun because like um, you may hear words like, wow, I just learned that word. So I just come here and just listen and just listen for words that I may you know, I don't expect to understand everything. I just kind of listen to it just to make sure, just to see what words I can understand and whatnot. So I was able to pick out a whole bunch of words I learned in Estonian. So I come here and watch the video. So. So this is what you can do. So there, there are no subtitles. You don't, don't use subtitles. I don't think you should use subtitles. There's been some people before talking about that. Um, it's good to listen to. Just go ahead and listen to it without subtitles. Now you, I know you have your, you have your court Estonian. to teach yourself Estonian. You have that other uh, basic course I just showed you. You will, of course, be looking at the text while listening to the audio. But when you come and watch like shows like this or whatever on YouTube or whatnot, then you don't don't look for subtitles. It's just good to listen without it because you want to see how much you can understand without using those subtitles because you'll be you'll be more focused on what they're saying instead of what's being written uh, instead of the translation. So I use this. I'm using this uh, I do this every day. I try to go here and list I try to go here to, and listen to something in Estonia every day without just just listen to what they're saying, try to get the uh you know, trying to get the gist of what they're saying. So, yeah. So I'm using this, and um, yeah. Uh, I also made a video on. Um, it's a. It's a. Uh, I made a video on a technique. It's the. Uh, it's the foreign language role running technique, and basically what it is, it, it's it's very good for beginners of a language because, basically, I break down what you need to learn at first. It, you go through those steps and learn all of that stuff. <clears throat> um, it gets you started right away and you go through those steps learn all those keywords learn all the important stuff and then I mean you can actually do that work on that stuff first before getting to a textbook I would advise you do that first and then you start working in the textbook 
but I will send you a link to that and I think you'll find it very useful so there may be some things you may have to ask you if you can't find it in the textbook you may be at a, you may um, ask a native speaker of Estonian or whatever language you're learning but it's a it's a very useful technique for for, for a beginner on learning a language because it, it there are just different steps you, you follow and it gets you started it's great so other than that um, oh yeah another thing while I'm watching this for example while I'm watching these type of clips these clips and whatnot I make my own like I'll just make up some drills okay like I talked about drills in that in that foreign language role running technique you make up your own sentences and stuff using everything you uh, you've learned you put together so I kind of make up my you know sentence here you see so while listening to that while listening to the the clip I'm I'll just I'm here just writing different drills just practicing all the stuff that I've I've learned so I will advise you to do the same thing so you keep your notes keep keep your folder I have me a folder for Estonian you see that keep your folder and keep all your notes in the folder and um, I know you've probably heard me mention chat rooms chat rooms are very good you go to chat rooms and practice this stuff you have to practice everything you learn look at my fancy handwriting <laughs> yeah so um, this is these are these are techniques I use I, so I just I have those those books there I, I use my notes and um, I have contact with native speakers if I have any questions I'll ask them and then I come here to YouTube and listen to the um, I listen to the clips and I go to chat rooms and practice and practice everything I learn. And of course, I'll make some videos, practice my spoken, getting feedback from the uh, native speakers. So I would definitely advise you to do that as well. Make some videos in the language you feel comfortable. Um, go ahead and make some videos. Just you know, give you whatever everything you learn. You want to make a video. That's what I do, and it'll be great for you. You be in Estonia for you know, I don't know how long you plan to stay there, but being living there you you should make a video talk about you know everything on a daily basis man i would say make a video once a week or something like that but uh yeah that's those are the resources i'm using for estonian and to be honest with you this is all you need just get you get a better dictionary i mean it's the, that this is an okay phrase book uh get you a um get you a better dictionary and get you a course book get it get teach yourself Estonian um, download that course I just showed you uh, and go listen to some clips listen do that take notes making your own drills you know using those instructions you've learned and uh, you'll be good to go you'll be good to go you'll learn Estonian swiftly so I uh, hope I'm not forgetting anything that'll be it and um, I will send you the links to uh, the technique, my, my foreign language role running technique. And I'll send you the link to the course book you can download over on Uzi Translations. Uh, if you have any other questions, just let me know. And um, I'll try to res I'll respond to you ASAP. All right. So that'll be it. And... Uh, those of you who have better resources or you guys have a resource I'm unaware of, uh, let us know and uh, that will be appreciated. Thanks for viewing the video.